What is Web 3.0? To understand it, let's look back at Web 1. This is the most primitive internet technology, with all the web pages being static and the same for everyone. Using Web 1, only the website's administrators could decide what content goes on the website. This all changed when Web 2 came around. This enabled social media websites such as YouTube or Facebook and now everyone is able to put their content online, creating dynamic feeds for different users. So what does Web 3.0 bring? Well, the technology is still in development, but the main principle is decentralization. Currently, all online content is stored on central servers which are usually owned by big companies. But this all can change using blockchain technology. In its core, Web 3.0 will work by storing data via encryption, meaning that a file can only be accessed with permission to do so. But it will also employ distributed computing, meaning that the file itself will be stored on many computers.